cumulus clouds, those little puffy little cotton balls, and they're moving to the southwest in that uh, low level northeasterly flow coming down this way. But notice these higher clouds here are actually flowing from the exact opposite direction from southwest to northeast. You're actually looking at wind shear right before your eyes. That is wind shear. That's a change in wind direction or speed with altitude, so you can actually see it on the satellite imagery. All right, here is what used to be Tropical Storm Fred. It is doing a number out there to the east with not just heavy rainfall, but also a severe risk. Look at this, a slight risk of severe weather for a large chunk of Pennsylvania and a part of Maryland and into New Jersey there. So they're de dealing with their problems out there, but for us, not a lot going on. You can see these little teeny little specks here on the map as I put the model into motion. There is a really small chance for a little pop up between now and maybe eight o'clock or so. Really not expecting much out there right now. Plan for most of us having a dry period, a balmy, beautiful evening. And then as we get into the overnight hours, quiet, nothing to worry about tonight. Just the humidity. It's going to be a mild night. And then as we get into tomorrow, same story. A few little pop ups are possible. Maybe a little bit better chance tomorrow than today. But you can see here the coverage is just not great. And then once we get into the evening hours tomorrow, they start to fizzle out. And by late evening, they're gone. So it's just that typical summertime pop up in the heat and then kind of fade off after sunset type of scenario both today and tomorrow. All right, tonight in the heat island, we're going to be only in the upper 60s for a low, a muggy night uh, out in the uh, boonies and burbs, as we like to say. It might be more like mid 60s, but you'll notice the, again that humidity that has come up. So tomorrow, partly cloudy overall, and again, a scattered shower or storm in the afternoon with a high in the mid 80s with a light and variable wind. And take a look, the heat, it keeps on coming, and you can tell with the overnight lows that that moisture is here. Look at this, upper 60s to near 70, well into next week. I think we do get relief in here after Wednesday, so it's going to be all the way to the end of next week, Sandra, before we get relief from the heat and humidity.